hello guys so welcome back i know we i didn't upload like i think uh, yeah like basically around three weeks so first thing was i got this new toy and one second one second yeah so basically i got this new toy the this uh, ta graphic tablet uh, and after that like i tried to practice a little bit and wanted to make this video and i started making a video but then I left for a trip, right? And yeah, I tried to went to Switzerland. They didn't let me in because of this Corona shit. Uh, and basically after that, I just went to Rome because like Italy is fully open and everybody that haven't been in Rome, yeah, I recommend just go and visit. Like basically, uh, basically it's a sick place with uh, a lot of things to see. So let, sorry, I have a tickle in the throat and yeah so what we got what I'm gonna show you is like what I learned on this graphic tablet and trust me it was like pain in the ass of the experience because I have to look like in the screen and focus uh, like my brain on the tablet and pressure right and yeah basically it's fun experience and I want you, everybody to try it and like this tablet they go like 200 euros and it's a good price for a beginning and I think it's better way to start digital art than if then if uh, then uh, if you would like upgrade to the like more expensive stuff like the screen tablets that quite some they cost quite some of the money and yeah so basically let's begin and enjoy but before that uh, just tell me I'm gonna tell you one thing uh, if you haven't subscribed and like this video and uh, you can look in uh, in description there's a link to my web store and maybe you find something nice if you like like some shirts and yeah something that I designed some paintings so yeah basically that's it enjoying the video okay guys so basically before we start make sure that pressure of your pen is right for you so now we're gonna start as you can see I used like the blue color for the sketching right and I make the pressure in, in the options and everything so basically what I do with the blue sketch I call it blue sketch uh, yeah so what I do is I just put a basic sketch from my head onto the paper and like it's not finished or anything just it's just like basic shapes and everything like a little bit of shadow just to get the feeling and the look of the picture right and a little bit of mid background and that's it and what I do next is like I go to the red color and redefine those lines so so they are more clear and everything that's like mid process where you not uh, you don't define like uh, lines but you you define a picture more so it's gonna so drawing is gonna look more like that than like the blue sketch was and after that I jump to the colors right and filling first I do is filling make some changes like on this part I remove the tongue from the drawing I thought it's gonna be too much the picture like it would ruin the picture and basically yeah what I do I do the filling first and then we're gonna do all of the outlines and I'm gonna show you how I do the outlines so yeah basically this is it like it's simple process what you have to do is stick with you uh, with your drawing and I know it's gonna look bad at first like still like this is my third digital drawing I think and I still don't like the finished result well, I mean other people say it's cool but for me not so really so yeah as you can see the outline what I do is like I took the darker shade or brighter shade of that color that's killing and do the outline and that's that's the idea that I got from the this artist 10 hundred right so <laughs> basically used to I always use like the black outline and on this mid process I tried this like with same color just darker or brighter and I like it more like it's more satisfying 
for me and as you can see like on this brown I did the lighter outline just to get like it pops more and everything and after the outline right so here on the lid I went with the color that's like too bright redid it again and everything and then went with the crossing and what's important like if you see I changed uh, my brushes like it depends what I do like I changed my brush like this one has like pressure sensitivity so the pressure I put on the pen it changes the size of my mark I leave on the paint uh, on the paper right and I go with the, this cross stitching uh, on the for the shades and highlights some highlights not really all and basically yeah like this part on the eyes like this one is like really bright right and when I move back <laughs> you can't really see that and that's my mistake but I don't know why but I stick with it I like it and everything so I don't <laughs> because like I don't really care what others think but as long as it satisfies me and yeah basically that's it like guys you just need to like practice and everything and everything will uh, come with the time right like whatever you do you just don't give up with it as it can be like bad at first and after months of practice you can get like awesome results okay guys so i hope you enjoyed in this video as much i did while creating it uh, creating it uh, pronunciation is shit today and yeah uh, so basically i hope you enjoyed it if you haven't uh, seen my last video uh, i'm gonna put it somewhere here and you can just click it and see it and yeah don't forget to subscribe and see you next time